Hello, best friend, and welcome back to my channel. Girl, I hope you're having a fabulous day. If this is the first time you're watching my channel, my name is Sebastian, and I welcome you guys with open arms. Happy Monday, you guys. I hope you're good. I am so incredibly grateful and thankful. I welcome you guys with open arms. Um, I hope you're having a good day. You know, Mondays are a great way to start brand new. I know there's a full moon tonight, so get your manifestation on. Get your 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 good energy in and release all the negative energy out. Um, also, you guys, today I started a really fun, amazing new journey, which I filmed for my members only. So the link is in the description if you want to join. It is a... It's a life transforming journey. So if you want to know more about that, make sure to click the link in the description. Um, but now that you're sit sitting down and have a snack and a drink, let's talk about Hailey Bieber because girl, she, you know, Hailey Bieber girl, she is really trying her hardest to just keep her head in the game, girl. She is trying her hardest just to keep her name out there, honey. She does not know what else to do. So she should know she should know by now that anything and everything she posts is going to be analyzed, it's gonna be talked about, it's going to be, you know, studied bitch, you know, at Harvard Law. Like people are going to take everything she puts out and 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 make something of it. And she knows it, okay? I can guarantee the girl knows it because she should know by now that after so many years of starting so many dramas herself, she knows that when she posts something, it's gonna get attention. So she posted this, which is just like a silly little meme, and it says, tired of working on myself, I will now be unapologetically insane. So people are literally running with this and saying, girl, really? So if that was working on yourself, I don't wanna know what, 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 what's coming, boo, you know, because damn. Um, listen, here's the thing about Hailey Bieber. She's actually, I'm starting to take a, I'm starting to look at her very different. I think she really is smarter than we all know, but smarter in, 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 in like a dark way, you know, not, not in a smart, get your coin, be liked by everybody way. She is, she is smart in a way of how to get attention negatively, negative attention. That's what she, you know, uh, I feel like she is like her own Willy Wonka and the drama factory because she just has all the gadgets. She has all the secrets. She has all, the, you know, secret uh, passageways, secret doors. You know, she has workers, you know, she has little Oompa Loompas running around, bitch, and just making her factory bigger and bigger and producing more drama and drama. You know, I, I mean, I, I, I just, I don't, I don't know how else to explain it. I mean, Girl, maybe I'm really in the need of some chocolate, honey, because damn, I, I, Willy Wonka? Oh my God, listen. Oh my God, this is so fucking embarrassing, but I had a crush on the Oompa Loompas. I did, and no, but <gasps> Willy Wonka? Like the original guy? Girl, he can get it, honey. I, I don't want the factory, bitch. I want you, okay? I want you and me in the chocolate river, honey. And the Oompa Loompas are Oompa Loompa, Oompa Dee Doo. Well, I twerk on Willy Wonka, bitch. Um, but anyways too too far too he, he doesn't care um so listen working on myself I, like she's done being the nice girl she's done working on herself and now she's going to be unapologetically insane here's the thing about this i really feel that Haley bieber can never ever ever really be taken serious and and here's and and, and you might think like sebastian is just a meme like you know, yes it's just a meme for you and I. Like you and I can post stupid shit, right? But the whole world is not watching you. The whole world is not judging you. You don't have this humongous army that Selena Gomez fans watching your every move to see what you're gonna say, to see what you're gonna do. And then they're gonna run with it. So you should know that. And that's why I always go back to her team saying, girl, do they hate her? Because you can't post these type of things. You actually have to really behave and you have to be on the lookout. And she has two major things that she has to take care of. She has to take care of Justin Bieber's mental health and she has to take care of her business road, right? Because everything that she does, all the drama she gets into, it's gonna affect both things. You know what I mean? It's gonna affect both, this was wrong. It's gonna affect both things. It's gonna affect Justin Bieber and it's gonna affect her, her company. And I feel like she just does not understand it. And yes, you can live in a world where you say, you know, you know what, fuck it all, fuck it all, fuck it all. Like, I don't give a damn about anything. But 
you're in a partnership with somebody who has built a very strong and huge career since the age of 13 years old like Justin Bieber and just because you don't know how to act right doesn't mean that you get to come over here and fuck up his career because a lot of people already are jumping ship from Justin Bieber believers because they're tired of Hailey Bieber's antics so I feel like you need to stop being so, you know, all about yourself and start thinking about your husband a little. But if he's okay with it, then girl, go on, girl. Open that, like, open that Charlie, open that Hailey Bieber, Charlie uh, drama factory, girl, and, and just go about your way, honey, for real. And, and, and you know, that's it. I, I, I just feel like I'm just not interested in, 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 in the golden ticket, boo. I'm not interested in the golden ticket of your drama factory, honey, because I just really feel it's gonna just, honestly, it's gonna crash and burn if you don't get your shit together. And the issue is that I, I made a video yesterday about how lucky she actually is because she has the whole world on her on her on her palm if she wanted it. She has access to money, access to contacts, access to connections, to opportunities, and she doesn't take it. She doesn't really a hundred percent live there because egos are in the way, because you think you can do whatever the fuck you want to do and get away with it. And it just is not it. You know what I mean? If two plus two is four and five plus five is ten, what the fuck is this? You know what I mean? Anyways, um, what do you guys think? Let me know in the comments. Going back, I'm so sorry. I forgot to tell you guys this in the beginning, but going back to the full moon thing, um, tonight, tonight is a full moon, right? Uh, and in full moons, I like to really um, kind of uh, just shed, okay? So if you have things that you've just been carrying and you just feel like your back is heavy, Tonight is a day to release, okay? Tonight is a night to release and to also manifest. So what I like to do first is release. I like to actually stand outside. I go to my balcony or when I walk the dogs or whatever at night, I just sort of like release things. So like, for example, if you are having anxiety or if you have depression or you have an issue with someone or or just whatever, whatever the case is for you, release it tonight. So just say like, I release my anxiety over this. I release all um, this negativity that I feel, I release feeling sorry for myself, I release hating myself, I release um, doubting myself, I release not, not thinking that I deserve to be happy. You know what I mean? Whatever you wanna release, just release it tonight. And then once you really feel like you released it, I like to take a shower, because I think it symbolizes like clean. And I love to turn my candles on, do a little sage, do a little uh, incense and palo santo. If you don't have that, it doesn't fucking matter, bitch. Just take a shower and then just sort of take that time to manifest. Even if you don't see the full moon, it's up there, girl. Your, your manifestations will, will get to the damn moon. So don't worry about that, okay? So just sort of like, you know, when you manifest, make sure to act like you already have it. Like I've, I've taught you guys this many times, so I'm grateful and thankful now that I have my dream job of being blah. I'm grateful and thankful now that I am married with blah. I'm grateful and thankful that Sebastian hit a million subscribers. You know what I mean. Um, so, you know, that's sort of the key for tonight. And, and for honestly, any night, you don't need a full moon, okay, bitch? And listen, the last thing I wanna say is if you're not in the mood for this whole production because you're in a bad mood or you're sad or you're depressed or whatever, or you're in a dark place, I get it. Take two seconds, two seconds. Even if you haven't showered in four fucking days, just take two seconds from your bed or your couch or wherever you're from and say, do the manifestations. Cause I promise it will plant a seed, a very small seed, but it planted and it will grow. When, when you least expect it, you're like, oh shit, I'm living my dream life. So I love you all so much. I'm so grateful. Make sure to join my new life journey in, this, in members only description in, in the link in the description. I love you all so much and I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye.